right now searching for a killer, a gunman in a deadly shooting. One woman was killed, another hospitalized. New information since the morning show about that double shooting outside a bar in the Newtown area. Two people shot, a car riddled with bullets. We just spoke with the owner of Kelly's Place. Channel 4's Ethan Calloway joins us live. So, Ethan, where does the investigation stand right now, and what did the owner tell you? Well, Bruce, that owner is really working right now to get things back to normal here, get things back up and running so he can open up his restaurant and bar again. Take a look. This is Kelly's place here on Kings Road. The owner was here this morning. I did have a chance to speak with him off camera. For now, though, police say someone fired around 40 shots from the street into this parking lot. A silver Honda Accord was sprayed with bullets. Two unidentified women were also hit. They were rushed to the hospital where one died and the other went into surgery. Now, that bar owner says he's seen these women here before, saying they live in the neighborhood and didn't notice anything unusual happen last night before the shooting. Uh, he tells me it was a little busier than uh, typically is on a Thursday night, but there was no issues until this happened around 930. Now, detectives have been questioning witnesses. That's the last word we have from them, uh, trying to figure out how all of this unfolded here. Still, though, not a whole lot of information uh, as far as the investigation moving forward. For now, we're live in Newtown. Ethan Calloway, Channel 4, the local station. Ethan, I know police asked the public to come forward with any leads they might have. Anything that you've heard about? Well, right now, Bruce, the last word we have from police is that they're looking for any surveillance video that might be available throughout this area that could give them any clues as to a car that was in this area or a person, someone who was responsible for this shooting. As of right now, though, no descriptions on a possible suspect. Bruce. Ethan Calloway, thank you. An update on the investigation on newsforjax.com. And tonight, starting at 4.